Hi, I'm Dr. Deborah Jeffries, Director of Healthcare Markets for Polycom. We're here in Andover today to introduce you to the Polycom Practitioner Cart. Let's get started. Now I'm sitting in front of the Polycom HDX 4000. We're going to use this device to connect with the Polycom Practitioner Cart. The Practitioner would be connecting from the 4000 or CMA desktop and the Practitioner Cart is located at a distance where the patient is found. Let's connect. Hi, this is Dr. Deb. I'm on the practitioner cart now and I want to show you some of the features. First of all, look up here and you'll see that we have a Polycom Eagle Eye camera. This camera is capable of doing 720p, 60 frames per second, or 1080p. We also have a 24 inch monitor and this monitor allows you to do dual monitor emulation. Let's move our attention to the center of the cart. Here, the first thing you'll see is a control panel. On the panel, you'll notice the up and down buttons. These buttons control the powered electronic lift that adjusts the height of the work surface and camera for seated or standing interaction. The cart includes a built-in battery and the display lets you know how much battery life is remaining. An audible sound will indicate when the battery power is low and needs to be recharged. Just below the display is a convenient on-off button. Just behind the control panel, you'll notice a large work surface where you can position the HDX microphone so it's out of the way but still picking up excellent audio. Below the work surface is a lockable storage bin. A large lockable drawer provides additional storage and is located just below the technology enclosure. This drawer features electronic keyless entry, which is accessed from the control panel at the front of the work surface. These storage areas are important because typically, you're using the practitioner cart for medical applications and the drawer or bin can be used to store medical devices safely and securely between uses. Just above the lockable drawer, you'll notice the technology enclosure and another work surface. This work surface provides additional space to place devices. The HDX 8000 Kodak is stored inside of the enclosure, which protects it from spills and risk of damage. From this perspective, we'll point out a very important feature, the powder coated finish, which allows you to very easily clean the cart and keep it ready to go. Let's take a look at the cart now from the side to point out a few more features that will be helpful for you. One important feature of the cart is an input-output panel. The I.O. panel is important because you'll be able to connect medical peripherals as you need to use them. For example, the general exam camera is attached to the S-video port and you can pick it up and use it to examine the eye or perhaps a dermatological lesion. Another important detail is a pull-out work surface where you can set a laptop or other device. This platform can be positioned on either the right or left side of the cart. On the back part of the cart, you'll find two bins where you can place medical peripherals like a total exam camera or an ECG or in this case, a Littmann electronic stethoscope. That way, they're convenient and ready to use when you're ready to use them. Finally, there's a cable management system on the back to make sure all cables and cords are stored and out of the way as you move the cart around. The base of the cart houses the battery and features a very small footprint that's designed to allow you to take full strides as you move the cart around your facility. I mentioned using a laptop which can be connected to the cart using the VGA port on the I.O. panel. This is important because you may want to be able to access PC applications like electronic medical records or ECGs or spirometers. Anything you can run on your computer, you'd want to be able to bring up have that available on the cart and show to the far end practitioner. This way, the physician can see any PC applications that's accessible by a browser at a distance as they're working with their patients. Here we see an image of a CT, and this image is being sent from the practitioner cart. I can also see an image of myself, and this is important because you want to know what the patient is actually seeing to make sure that they're making a good connection with you. At some point during a remote evaluation, we may want to bring in additional medical specialists. We can add another person to the call by simply hitting the green call button on the remote control 
or dialing into a bridge, thus creating a three-way call. In this case, our second specialist is working from his mobile device. From the mobile device, the specialist sees and interacts with the patient and the other remote physician, as well as seeing the same content that is being shared. The remote expert also has far-end camera control, which allows him to zoom in, pan, or tilt the camera on the practitioner cart to get a better look at the patient for more in-depth consultations. We've just taken a look at the Polycom practitioner cart, which supports multiple applications within the telehealth and healthcare market. If you have additional questions, please contact us at 1-800-POLYCOM. Have a great day.